We begin this week's Tenants Premiership show with the Edinburgh Derby between Heriots and Curry. Other than a one-sided match at the Orium last season, this game, whether in league or cup, has traditionally provided a very exciting, dramatic finale. Vernal at the line-out. Here's Charlie Shale. Tom Gordon intruding. Gregor Hunter. It's out to Joe Reynolds. Reynolds ball in two hands. Back inside to Tom Gordon. Great opening score for Curry. Here he is under the uh, Curry posts. Simmers goes right and Jack McLean scores. Second half now, Curry trailing at half time. But uh, Captain Robbie Nelson bulldozes his way through that somewhat ineffectual tackle. Michael Linus, the Harriet's hooker. Advantage coming. Simmers alert to give Harriet's the lead again. We're inside the last minute now. Curry on the attack. Shield goes lateral. Inside to Reynolds. Reynolds to Robbie Nelson. And, as we said, a dramatic finish. Curry take the points. Both teams were still looking for their first one of the season at uh, Mansfield Park. Robert Lovett wins that line-out for Edinburgh Ackies. Here comes the drive from the pack. And Callum Black surges over. Hoik now. It's a teenager, Andrew Mitchell, battling hard to set up the ball. Lightfoot, nice step from Sean Muir, back to Declan Lightfoot, and the Hoik scrum half scores. Muir again. Some good skill from the prop. Hoik's captain goes over the whitewash. Hoik scrum in the ascendancy, and referee Sam Grove White rules penalty try. Ackies with Cameron Gray, five metres short. Robbie Davis snipes. The scrum half goes in. Second half now. Black again. Oh, not held. And he's able to squirm over for the try. Aki's now pressing. George Spencer. What a great finish from the centre. He enjoyed that. So Aki's hanging on to the lead. But there we go. Lee Armstrong over. And Hoyk secure their first win of the Tenants Premiership. Leaders Air came to Megatland and uh, enjoyed the first half. Ball going out wide. Back inside to Stafford McDowell. His circus contract might be forthcoming with that good juggling. Boromir striking back. Aubrey McCoob in the back row. And it's uh, that man, Johnny Matthews, going over for his sixth try of the season. Fraser Climo out to McDowell. And easy as you like for the former Scotland under-20 captain. Climo again threatening, keeping the, uh, the Barham Muir back row very much on their toes. Daly Armstrong. Quick ball for air. Out it goes. McDowell, the provider. Grant Anderson, the finisher. And then before half-time, bonus point try. Fraser Climo going over. Second half now. Jordan Edmonds. The Scotland Club 15 winger goes over. Air working the ball out. 
Scotland's seventh cap, Robbie Nairn scores. Advantage coming here. And suitably embellished by Blair McPherson. Burramuir managing their third try. And at the uh, back of this driving wall, it's that man Matthews. At the Green Yards, it's a repeat of the BT Charity Shield final, but on this occasion, Melrose emerged victorious. Jason Baggett to Fraser Thompson, alarm bells ringing. Claude down. What's Jason Baggett here? Manages to squeeze in at the flag, try given. County, five metres from the uh, Melrose line. It's driving wall time. You see uh, Rainer Kennedy just having a little look, getting his bearings before going back to the subterranean world of the driving mall and scoring. And if Rainer Kennedy could do it, Russell Anderson said, I'll have a piece of that. Ball transferred back from Grant Runciman. A bit of communication with the scrum half. Was the ball coming out? Not a chance. Anderson scores. Now, Fraser Thompson again, galloping up the uh, touchline. Back to Runciman. Runciman, one-handed offload. Terrific finish. Try for Murdo McAndrew. Melrose again. Looking to counter from deep. Thompson now. Up the stand touchline. Kicks ahead. How's the bounce? Oh, fly hacks off his left foot. And Murdo McAndrew just about manages to stagger over for the uh, host's fourth try. Finally to ball grey, Watsonians were up 31-0 at half time. Opening try there from Rory Hutton. Jamie Hodgson, the big telescopic reach. And uh, here goes Watsonians, getting a bit of momentum to this mall. Jack Stanley scores. Now, Connor Boyle, the teenage flanker, Scotland under 18 cap from last season, eventually clawed down. Out it goes. DJ Innes carves his way in for the try. And the loose ball picked up by the Watsonians fullback, Josh Rowland. Second half now. And Boyle in at the posts. Watsonians just trying to crank up this uh, driving mall. Here we go. And referee awards Boyle his second try. Is this the driving mall try of the week? It's Hawks number eight, Gary Adams. Some slick hands. The outside route, Murray Godman scores for Hawks. Watsonians, again giving width to the ball. Gregor Nelson slicing through for their seventh try. Oh, ball goes loose. Scott Peffers on the charge. And here's Bobby Beatty. Touchdown. And Beatty adroitly following up that kick ahead. At least a bonus point for Hawks.